You know, watching the new trailer for the Diablo mobile game, I noticed something that sort of put into perspective part of why I feel like Blizzard has let the series go. No, it wasn't the fact that the cinematic was an entirely soulless battle fight between miscellaneous fantasy dudes, and in direct contrast, the emotional resonance in the remake of the Warcraft 3 intro cinematic made it feel like almost a massive leap forward rather than a look back. I mean, I did notice that, but what I really noticed was the music. It's very, very bland. Now you might say this is because Blizzard has been dead set on turning Diablo into standard fantasy since the third game, but I don't think that's entirely it. What I think it is is just because Matt Ullman left, which is a real shame because... From iconic flurries to his deeply atmospheric stuff, he was a huge mark on these games. He was incredibly good at setting mood, which was imperative for the Diablo games. And in StarCraft, one of the most important parts of any resource management game of any caliber is a good soundtrack because that's what's gonna keep you from going crazy. He started working as a composer for Condor, which turned into Blizzard North when Blizzard acquired it. Blizzard North's first game, Diablo, had music that was very, very well received. So well received that they snatched him up to do StarCraft's music. After that, he went back to Blizzard North to work on Diablo 2. The music Matt Ullman made was a key part of why people love Blizzard North's games, and he left with a lot of them to join Ruinic Games, who did Torchlight 1... Torchlight 2... and Hob. Unfortunately, that was shut down too. So now he's in the wind. I hope he works on more things in the future, or he has been working for a million years, so maybe he's just gonna retire. I don't know. I don't know the guy. And that's all this video is about. I wanted to talk a little bit about one guy who did some good stuff, who I really feel needs a little more exposure rather than, you know, talking about how Blizzard treated my baby bad. But you might be saying, if Diablo's your baby, why not talk about that a little more? Why not go into detail about why you're mad? And the reason for that, and the most damning thing I can say about it is... You know why. That's why you're here. And I don't need to, because everyone else already has.